great hazards of adult life, trying to keep as many teeth as you can. It's especially difficult if you play hard-hitting hockey. But help could soon be at hand for athletes or anyone sporting a toothless grin. It's a Canadian invention that not only plugs the gaps, but fills the holes with brand new pearly whites. CTV's Deborah Shirey explains. Chris Miller getting some time in uh -oh. spot and Ryan Smith is down and hurt. It was a jaw-dropping shot as Edmonton Oiler Ryan Smith takes a puck to the face, and yes, those are his teeth. It's too late for Smith's smile, but researchers at the University of Alberta could have a cure for future toothless hockey grins. An ultrasound device that regrows human teeth. Tariq Albiali was researching jaw growth in rabbits. Accidentally, when I applied the ultrasound, I found the lower incisor grow, grow, grow. Albiali is the first to try the treatment on humans. After 20 minutes a day, new teeth started to grow in a month. With this device, we'll get this roots together, held them together healing it together and keep it forever. Albi Ali's machine was too big, so he teamed up with nanotech expert Jai Chen, who scaled it down from this to this. After you using this treatment, then you can throw away. So this is like a one-time use for you, and you can put it on easily. What we're working on is more like a user-friendly. Professors at the University of Alberta have already filed a patent for this invention. While it's obviously still in the prototype phase, scientists here are hopeful it could hit the market in as little as two years. It would have a fantastic practical application. No one knows more about losing teeth than Oilers dentist Anthony Sneezewell. He says time is limited when it comes to saving teeth. If we can get to the point where it doesn't matter because we can use this device, then it's going to improve situations where we can reimplant teeth and they'll, they'll be successful long term. For now, all the attention has taken Tariq Albiali off guard. No, I don't have time to see my patients. <laughs> and he can't wipe the smile off his face. Deborah Shirey, CTV News.